What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me. Today, we're talking about Red Dead Redemption 2. Yes, I was alive when the internet broke over the reveal of Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm super excited about it. As a fan of the original game, this has been something that I've wanted for many, many years, and I'm super, I just, I'm so hyped to see the direction that Rockstar goes with this game. It's apparently a prequel, and it's going to be something, you know, it's going to really shake up the world. It's going to be, in my opinion, just as big as GTA 5. It's going to be amazing. Uh, but apparently, Sony is going out of their way to uh, secure that most gamers play on their platform, very similar to the way that they did uh, with Activision and Destiny, believe it or not. And I'll drop a link in the description. Red Dead Redemption 2 will have something exclusive for PlayStation 4 gamers original game coming to PlayStation now. So for the people who are on PS4 now, you can play the original. Red Dead Redemption 2 is on its way to the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, but Sony is doing its best to make sure you play it on PlayStation 4. Sony announced today that through a deal with publisher Rockstar Games, players of the PS4 version of Red Dead Redemption 2 will receive, quote, first access to learn select online content in the game, end quote. That doesn't sound like much of a benefit, Sony and Rockstar aren't promising that PS4 players will get exclusive content, just that they'll be able to access something ahead of Xbox One players. And it sounds like the content will be specific to Red Dead Redemption 2's quote, new online multiplayer experience, end quote. Still, the language could be referred to a deal similar to Destiny, where players on PS4 can earn items like exotic weapons before they're available to obtain on Xbox One. Sony also announced that the PlayStation 3 version of the original Red Dead Redemption will be released on PlayStation Now soon. The full game streaming service is available on Windows PC, which means that the PlayStation Now debut of Red Dead Redemption will mark the first time the game has ever been playable on PC. Rockstar never ported Red Dead Redemption to the PC, to the great dismay of many fans. PlayStation Now is a subscription-based service that costs $20 a month or $45 for a three-month period. However, people who own an Xbox One and Red Dead Redemption can play the game at no additional cost. It joined the backwards compatibility program in July. This is pretty telling that the tug of war between Sony and Microsoft isn't going anywhere anytime soon. I'm actually pretty shocked to see uh, this type of acquisition with Rockstar and Sony, but then again, you know, as a developer, you got to go to where the money is. And, you know, some developers are going to go with Microsoft, like, you know, Square Enix went with Microsoft with Tomb Raider. Microsoft gave them a bag full of money. They threw a boatload of money at Square Enix. And apparently Sony is throwing a boatload of money at Rockstar because they know how insanely popular Rockstar games are. GTA 5 is one of the best selling games of all time. Uh, I, I, I'm trying to remember exactly how many millions it sold, 60 million units. It's just, it's phenomenally well received. And people who play Grand Theft Auto are going to love Red Dead Redemption. And they're going to love Red Dead Redemption 2, and Sony knows it. So Sony is angling to get as many Red Dead Redemption 2 players on the Sony side of the fence early. You know, in, in contrast to what's going on with the gaming environment with the Xbox One S and the Xbox Scorpio, if Red Dead Redemption hardcore fans know that they're going to get early access or get maybe some perks on the PlayStation format, then yeah, they're going to jump over to that side. I'm super excited about Red Dead Redemption 2. You guys let me know what you think about Red Dead Redemption 2 and whether or not early acquisitions of online multiplayer functionality means a lot to you when it comes to picking the console you play on. Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and check out BeastlyGamer.com to become my best friend. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.